hi guys welcome to today's vlog so from literally out of nowhere we decided to take a little getaway just because the world has been so crazy lately and it's just it's really taking a toll on my mental state and if you guys follow on instagram probably know what i'm talking about and i'm very vocal i'm very open and what i believe in and everything like that and at the same time i'm really respectful because i know that not everybody's gonna agree with me and it's it has not been bad with that but just like the constant news and everything like that that we decided to just take a mental break now that Josue has a four-day weekend um because of the whole labor day stuff so and like it's just it's gonna be just it's just i don't know it's just been really, really crazy so we decided to go go take two days off and like no social media or anything i am gonna be vlogging and stuff like that um i am gonna be recording but i'm not gonna post it until i get back because i just don't want to i don't want to be on social media you know but i came to do my nails um and i and i'm switching to another place right now that somebody told me about because the last place as you guys saw last time i just got up and left because it was like 40 40 50 minutes and nobody even came so i just got a little upset um i need to do my toes because they are really bad but all right so i'm gonna go do that and then we're gonna go back home and pack and do all these things but so yeah if you're not subscribed don't forget to subscribe to my channel and yeah let's go do our nails and i still need to get the thing for my phone because you know and i don't have time to eat so i just got a banana and let's go all right i am home and that took guys that took like two hours let me show you that took like two hours but they look pretty good not bad but we're running out of time we need to leave okay hold on let's see if isaac comes to the door to see him walk, I, I brought him run, I brought him flying. I know, I'm like, I wanted to see him running. <laughs> Hi, you baby. Hi, I chick baby. I chick baby. I chick baby. I baby. Where are you going? He loves the outside. Where are you going? Hi, you baby. Hi. Come on, we can go over there. If I let him, he'll start running everywhere. See? <laughs> Come on, we gotta go. We gotta go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're going to go pack for Isaac. <laughs> he loves the stairs so much. Careful. Come on. Uh. Ay, hey, sorry. Please don't touch that. <laughs> now, baby. Over here. Come, Isaac. Okay, so I'm trying to find. This guy is not going to let me do anything. Isaac, Isaac, he's gonna destroy that book, but I am trying to find, <gasps> no, you're gonna break it, this is his favorite book right here, and he's gonna break it, it's the peekable one, it's so good, this, it has like, Peekaboo! It has a lot of them and it's really, really good. He really likes it. But I can't let him touch it because it's one of his favorites and he's gonna... He is gonna damage it. But yeah, I have everything that I need for him in this corner. So I need his pack and play. Oh my god, you saw him. <laughs> <laughs> I need his pack and play cover. What else do I need? I need his fan. Wow. <laughs> I 
I need his swim undies, which it's gonna take four. It's gonna take four. Uh oh, he found the stash. I literally have everything in here in this little corner. Bebe. Why do they do this? I don't know why they do this. Bless you. I need you out of there, bebecito. Go play over there. Look, Mr. Pineapple. This is his favorite. Look, Mr. Pineapple. <laughs> I need the packing cubes. That's it. No more from here. Hello? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Ah! Jeez. Jeez. <laughs> 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 Jeez. Oh, Sorry, baby. You fell and hit yourself, and I'm over there like, I see. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah. All right. So I'm gonna take three overnight diapers. Um, how many diapers? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Maybe just these. Mm, maybe one more <laughs> of diapers, and then I'll take a pack of wipes. This pack. And then, what else? I think there's shoes. Oh, yeah, there's shoes in here. Have his shoes. For his hair. What else do I have in here? A little book. Pineapple book. Maybe I'll take these. He hasn't worn them. I want him to wear it. So, yeah, I'll take those as well. So this is all I have so far and I'm going to take this curling cream for him and then this one as well and then this small wash and shampoo. Actually no, I have a better one in here which is from the Honest Company. Yeah, the Honest Company. Oh that's lotion. Oh actually no, I'm going to take this one. Um, I'm going to take, actually no, I'm going to take no, I will never, ever, ever use a vino again. This one, yeah. So I'm gonna take this one. And then. His. Hi. <laughs> his clothes. Oh, I need this. Actually, this is for Mosquito. I don't need a Mosquito one. Um. Let's see. Oh my god, guys, look at this. Isaac. Hey. I need his hat. He took something. I just don't know what he took. Um, he needs some socks. Some socks. Some socks. Oh my god. He's going to the chair. Mm -hmm. Bye. He's on the chair. <gasps> oh my gosh. Excuse me. Can you get off the chair? That's like amazing, amazing. Just, just great, Isaac. Just, just great. Isaac, come on, get down. <laughs> I can't with that child. But I'm trying to find the bag that I use for Isaac's stuff. Like, where did I? Oh, it's in the closet in our room. Our room. Oh. Yeah. So there's a bag that I bought just for him. Oh, he's coming. Just for Isaac. Oh, right here. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh gosh. This one. This is just for Isaac, this blue bag. Your son is in the closet. Uh, well, I gotta go. Ah, and it actually has things already in here, which is good from our last beach getaway. I need to get him out of here. Isaac, come on, baby. So yeah, this is gonna be his bag. Come on, it's only two days, come on. Come Isaac. 
doing those. Yes. Can you stop taking things away? And he climbs this, so. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm gonna pack all this and then I'll ask to take clothes out also. All right, let me go do all this stuff and then I'll show you guys. All right, so he has like clothes that he has not used in here. And I just saw this set, which I think will be perfect for both days. Um, Not this one, but like this teal and like army one. <laughs> wow and it is 18 months but he's actually fitting into it already so i'm gonna take isaac my goodness i'm gonna take that and then i gotta get his pjs oh my god he got on top of the chair again <laughs> you're dangerous oh my gosh baby no isaac you can't get here oh my god oh my god oh my god Oh my god. All right, I gotta do something with that chair because he can't keep getting on top of it. Oh my gosh. I'm sweating, guys. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Isaac. Does this fit you? <laughs> What'd you say? Just say it again. Come on. You want to share? <laughs> He's eating some mangoes and sweet potato. And then I have some rice with veggies to give him after he's done because he makes way too much mess with rice because obviously you like he doesn't know how to use a spoon yet i'm still trying to teach him and then i have his water is she good and we have to hurry up because it's already four hmm? <laughs> so yeah, i'm just feeding him this rice i'm not gonna lie like i honestly do need this break kind of um i don't know i just feel like my heart kind of hurts like i just feel like i don't know i don't even know how to explain it just like it just pains me to see how crazy the world is right now and like people and I don't know, just some friends that have really been disappointing me because obviously, you know, we can have different opinions, bebe, abre la boca, different opinions in life. Um, and that's normal because we're not all going to think the same. Like, how boring would life be if everybody thinks the same, right? Obviously, I would love everybody to, you know, think like me, obviously, but, you know, I just have to be respectful and know that it's not going to happen. But people are just so rude and mean ah uh, ah uh, he doesn't isaac come on baby i don't know part of me also doesn't even want to go just because i i don't know i'm just tired i'm just so emotionally tired right now Like, I want no responsibilities right now. Like, if I could, if you guys could feel the stress inside my veins in life right now, like, this is what people tell you that social media is nothing. Like, you guys might see me on YouTube here and like, okay, you know, I know her life, whatever, but it's, it's so much more. That's why I always, I always treat people with grace down social media and I don't believe everything people tell me because I know how different somebody's life can be not only what social media says like what people like see whatever um 
I'm just I'm just so overwhelmed right now like I don't even I can't like and you would think that those people that are, are supposed to be there for you will be there for you but just, no it's too much for people to be there for other people nowadays so it is completely fine so I don't know I just hope this outing just like with no social media just oh my I'm just, just tired. I'm just really tired. All right, guys. So this is what I'm taking: some snacks. All these are like snacks and pouches. I'm also taking almond milk, and then I'm taking some bananas, some avocados. And then I'm taking also some French toast, syrup, some bread, and peanut butter for Isaac, blueberries. Also, so what if I'm wearing now? Hmm? You got me for shorts, casual, got, clothes yeah. casual, and for swimming. It's mm -hmm. only like yeah, two days we're gonna be there. I already bought everything. Oh, just my yeah. shoes and my personal stuff. Yeah. put everything in this in here and then I'm making some food to take I'm also taking my lemon cake because why would I leave my lemon cake here you know um yeah so here's everything I have purse Isaac's thing um I don't think I'm gonna take toys. Does he really need toys? I don't know. I don't think he needs toys, but just in case, I'm just gonna take the carrots. He's missing one carrot <laughs> right here. So yeah, I'm just gonna take one toy. The carrot I really likes. And that's it. And then, oh, also. We need so we need the oh my god look at this mess okay I think it's in here we need the umbrellas and those beach chairs are right here here it is one guys guys listen to me <sighs> listen to me i have a story for you guys you don't want to miss this story it's been Wait, what? Wait, what? what is this what is in there is that chicken no just... no this is just parking, this is parking. oh we have been to three hotels. Three. You know what three means? And we keep canceling our booking and going to another one because of issues. I can't even make this up. I can't even make I I I I need to tell you guys a story because I am shook. And where's the entrance for this? Yo. This hotel even gave us a goodie bag. And he knew how bad the other ones were. He told me. He was like, you went down north, right? Didn't you? Oh, my God. I was like, how did you know? He was like, everybody ends up coming here from there. Oh, my God. Can you believe that? Wow, that guy's awesome, then. Right. And they gave me a goodie bag, and they have a Starbucks. I, re I read over here the, on the other side of this thing. Oh, uh, okay. Let's take him out. Oh, my gosh, guys. Yay, Isaac. Moment <sighs> of truth. You and Isaac. Huh? Um, yeah. 
This is what I'm talking about. Oh, this smells clean. It looks clean. Yes. 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 Is it clean? Am I am, am I being deceived? Imagine. Am I imagining things? What are the lights on? Are they lying to me? I took a check. Huh? I think. I think this is clean. This is for you. Oh my god, the difference. The difference, guys. Oh my gosh. The difference. Like amazing. Like this is this is amazing. This is what a good wall looks like. This is what a good Stop doing that, baby. Oh, the fridge. Microwave. Yes, baby. Hi. So, guys, I have totally forgotten to take my camera out, but I wanted to um, vlog. But, as you guys saw, it's just... It's been special being here. Very special. And, I don't know, I feel like it happens to me all the time when we go out. And I don't even look for stuff to happen but i feel like things like look for me i don't know i i, I don't know you know whatever as long as we're alive i guess but um we're actually going to the fair right now we just finished eating and oh my gosh i've never been so full in my life like i needed that food like it's it, it's literally our first meal of the day and it's 7 27 so we just ate we've been eating like random stuff because we were just so exhausted and isaac really gave us a hard time this morning to take a nap he was dying like his eyes were like falling but for some reason he was refusing to nap which we don't understand he just like, okay, like we do understand like he's out of place right now he's not home so he feels weird and stuff like that um and he was exhausted hey why are you throwing stuff and he's getting tired but look <laughs> <laughs> he's getting tired but i know that he'll love the fair so we're not gonna be here a long time but i do want him to like get on some rides this is his first time in the fair and if you don't know we are in myrtle beach you guys know we love myrtle beach we came two years ago when i was pregnant with isaac um it was really really nice so yeah we just ate and oh i'll put the pictures here it was so good so yeah i want to go now you got the pass Oh, and chica chick. What a cute shoe. Oh, sure. Isaac. Isaac, baby. Look at looks. Hi. Hi. He sucks. Isaac. Baby, hey, hola. Hello. You look so cute. Pretty. Camera does not even make like give it just this. Like the camera's just like what? Like what? He's fine. He's fine. He's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Hi, Jay. <laughs> no, bebe, no, bebe, bebe, sit down.
Bebe. Hello. He's not for the camera. Bebe. <laughs> forgot to end <laughs> the vlog um we it was everything was just so crazy that i was like okay i just want to enjoy this vacation and be present and if you guys don't know i did kind of leave social media for that weekend because um yeah everything was just a little too crazy for me so yeah i even deleted my instagram account and everything because i just want to be present um but anyways long story short guys i okay so this is a saturday right i called the resort because i know that some resorts don't allow you to do late check-in whatever so i was calling nobody was answering like nobody was answering it was like 3 p.m nobody was answering it was four or five like nobody was answering we started going there on our way at 6 30 I was calling and calling, nobody answered. We got there. It was seven thirty. No, it was eight. Yeah, it was like eight. Um, and I'm like, okay, let's just park. I'm like, okay, this place looks not like the pictures. I was like, that's kind of weird. Whatever. Then we kept on walking, and then when when I told Josue to stay with Isaac in there, and I would just go check in because under my name anyway. So when I went, I saw that it was locked. It had like a lock, not even like a normal lock. It had like one of those cheapy locks i'm like whatever i'm like okay this place already looks like a motel which i don't understand it has great reviews and people never said it was a motel so i i was like okay this place is not closed right it's not closed i see a letter on the door and it pretty much says we're not here call for emergency this number i'm calling i'm calling i'm calling josue and me and isaac are outside in our cars we're calling nobody answers i'm like these people actually left and closed the hotel and sorry Isaac it's like screaming in the background right now but yeah these people actually l closed the hotel and we're stranded here I was like are you kidding me so I called Expedia and I'm telling them like hey I need, I need another hotel whatever and the guy is trying to find something around our budget the same budget and everything um, and they're willing to actually pay for an upgrade also so he's telling me which are my options and everything and we started driving to eat to get some food because it's already like 8 8 30 9 10 10 30 and i'm like bruh like i cannot believe this thing with Expedia is taking so long and like i even have proof on my phone like that's how long it took for them to find us another hotel and then when he finally found one we went over there and okay it looked a little the guy from the front was a little weird so i didn't really expect think anything at this point it was like 11 30 and i'm like okay whatever this guy whatever you know the hotel looks huge it looks like like a resort like it's really nice it's really nice whatever so we start walking upstairs and i just noticed how everything's really dark and dull and like it smells weird and it feels like i'm going into a dungeon mind you this is a huge hotel like humongous like i'm sure it was good at some point but it was just like i was like okay whatever so we guys we walk into the room i don't even know if i recorded this i honestly don't remember we walk into the room and i'm telling josue you know this hotel is way better than the last one we're in and i started saying you know this is you know god is watching out for us and right when i say god is watching out for us josue starts killing bugs with his feet 
and I'm just like, what? I'm like, let me just take my words back into my mouth, right? And I, he starts like, he's like, oh, this is a cockroach. I, all I hear is him stepping on cockroaches, stepping on bugs. And I'm like, there's no way that this is happening right now. We keep on, you know, walking around the room, whatever, the walls. There's like bugs on the walls. The windows don't even open. It looks like there was a wind, a huge window and somebody ripped it off. And like somebody ripped, ripped the cover from the window because it looks like something's missing. Like something was peeled. It looks so disgusting, so nasty. There's like bugs over the window, spider webs. The walls are coming apart. I'm going to insert the pictures here because Josue did take pictures. I was like, oh my gosh, like, what is this? Like, I could not believe th this was happening. So we went downstairs. I told the guy, like, really quietly, I told him, like, hey, like, this is just not working out for us. Like, can I, can I get another room? Like, and he's like, oh, you know, okay, okay, you know, it's okay. Let's do this. He said, here, go you by yourself. Check out the room. Mind you, I was so, so nervous to go check out another room by myself because the hallways and just the room, the lights, like, they have it dull on purpose so nobody will notice the disgustingness that they have. And I will tell you guys the name of the place because... It is literally barbaric for them to have this like that. They are not investing money into cleaning this hotel. Absolutely not. Nobody cleans this hotel. They go, they wash the sheets, and they put them back. Like, nobody cleans. Like, I I know nobody cleans. There's absolutely no way somebody cleans his, this hotel, right? So, um, yeah, I go upstairs and everything, and then I'm just, like, scared out of my life that somebody's going to come out and, like, kill me, rape me, whatever. Like, I'm, just, like, I'm, like, scared at this point. I start looking at the walls and the floors, the same thing as the other room. I was, like, forget it. I'm not the like, type of person to do this, so I was, like, struggling with myself and Josue. I was, like, should we just stay here? Like, I don't want to, like, have to tell him, like, we're leaving. Like, I hate doing this, whatever, but I was, I did not care. I went downstairs and told the guy, no, it's not working out for us. I'll call Expedia to get my money back. I'm sorry, you know um just put down that we left whatever and um yeah we left the guy was super rude because i told him that i was leaving when he was so nice in the beginning but then he ended up being really rude and i was just like okay all right <laughs> um and by the way i did leave him leave him a review on google already and they were not happy about it so i honestly don't care um and yeah i just literally well, literally left i i i we stayed in the car for like half an hour at this point, it's already like, I think it's uh, 12, 12.30. We stayed in the car for like an extra like half an hour looking for a hotel. And the more I looked at hotels in the area in Myrtle Beach, the more I saw, I saw that every hotel had a roach issue. I was just like, are you kidding me? Like every hotel had a roach issue, all of them. So... I was like, no, we're going to a different area from Murder Beach. So I found another one. It was li literally like double our budget. But I was just like, forget it. Like, I'm tired. I came here to like de-stress, no social media. We need this. And I was like, forget it. Let's just put in a credit card. Let's just pay for it, whatever. So that's what we did. And guys, it was the best hotel ever. I'm literally saving the name forever. I'm Every time I go to Murder Beach, I'm going to go to that one. I'm going to start saving from now on. Because that hotel was absolutely amazing. It was so good. They gave us a goodie bag, as you guys saw. A little... Oh, I have it right here, actually. It's nothing out of this world, but it smelled clean as soon as I walked in. Like, it was just like... Oh, this is the name. Um, right here. This is the name right here. What is it? I forgot the name. Surfside Beach. It was absolutely amazing. I loved it. We're going back to that one all the time. It was clean and just like... The, I, me just thinking of Isaac walking in the other hotel, like walking and crawling on the floors just made me like want to like pull my skin. But in this one, it just felt super clean and I'm just never gonna trust another hotel that is like a good price ever again. I learned my lesson. But yeah, guys, this is a story and absolutely horrible, like absolutely horrible and <laughs> yeah that's what happened to us when we were trying to save some money so um not even save some money it was still pricey not gonna lie that one was that the one that was like really bad that one was not cheap that one was a little expensive which that's why i agreed with the expedia guy to take it like i thought we we're getting a huge deal i'm like whoa expedia's about to hook us up you know but no that's not what happened but 
Anyways, I'm just going to edit this vlog and upload it for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. We love you guys. God bless you. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye, guys. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. Just a bit of sugar to that hobbit bitter. Maybe you taste different.